Hey guys, Owned by Tomato here. I wanted to show how to properly track a Pokemon in Pokemon Go. I want to start out saying that this whole clip is uncut. It's sped up to times two speed because I tracked two Pokemon, and I wanted to show the whole process of me tracking those Pokemon. So there's a whole bunch of different strategies and rumors out there for how to track a Pokemon. Um, I found a lot of them to be inconsistent. Uh, I know that a popular one right now is the green circle or green square emanating from the bottom right whenever you select a Pokemon to track. Uh, I found a whole bunch of inconsistencies with this. I don't know if it's uh, like server lag or what it is, but I wasn't able to actually track any Pokemon that way. I was trying to pa track a Poliwag for about an hour and had absolutely no luck with it. I, I ended up giving up on him. So notice that I keep pulling up the nearby menu in the bottom right. The further to the top left that the Pokemon you're tracking is, the closer in proximity to all the other Pokemon that that one is to you. So if he's going up in the in the list, he's getting closer at, in regards to the other Pokemon. If he's dropping down like it, like the Eevee just did, he dropped down from first to third. That means I'm, I went too far and I'm going in the wrong direction. Other Pokemon are getting closer and he's getting further away. So whenever I saw that, I immediately turned around and then I went back in the direction I was going because and then I went across the street instead of going to the left, I went to the right. So as the footsteps start dwindling down, it goes from three, which means he's 300 meters away, then two, around 200, and then one means he's 100 meters away, which is very close. Uh, so I, I noticed that he's not in this patch of grass, so I know he has to be in one of the other ones really close, so I actually go across the street. And that's when I actually find the Eevee, and as you notice that the last time I pulled up the nearby menu, I saw a pincer. Now pincers can pop up in really high CP levels. I found one that was 1100 uh, yesterday, so I wanted to go and track this pincer. So I, I embarrassingly miss like five great balls, and then uh, he breaks out and runs away immediately. Anyways, I found the Pokemon that I was looking for. So I start tracking the pincer. Now, I know that when I tap those blue circles, I know that he's not in that direction, because that's the direction I just came from. So instead of a 360 degree search radius, I only have to search 180. So I know it's a pretty good bet that if I start going straight, um, he'll start getting closer on the list. Notice that I keep pulling it up, I keep tracking him. He started in the bottom right, and now he's in the top three. So I know I'm headed in the right direction, He has, and as long as he keeps moving forward on that list, I know I'm heading and getting closer to him. So I keep, I keep tracking that until another Pokemon pops in front of him. And in this case, it's gonna be the Rattata. Um, in just a second, uh, he'll get down to, I, I believe it's one footstep. And then I keep going straight just to try and generate a search radius. I keep going straight, and then until the Rattata pops in front of him, I know that I, I don't know if I'm headed in the right direction or not. As soon as he gets knocked down to number two, I immediately turn around because I went too far. That means other Pokemon are getting closer and he's getting farther away. So I see that he's second, I turn around, and I know that he's not in the direct opposite path, so I go across the street and decide to search over there. And that's where I actually find him. But yeah guys, it's a it's a combination of trial and error, and knowing that it's a 360 degree search radius whenever he pops into the menu. Um, so as soon as they pop into the nearby menu, uh, it's you know that you have 180 degrees. You can pretty much go straight and then track him from there. Anyways guys, I hope you enjoyed this. This has been Owned by Tomato. Later guys.